in the past I've used the ABX tool that comes with FUBAR 2000 and I've blogged about it. I've also demonstrated how to do level matching for same source comparisons and I've done that in this comparison between the Rode NT2A and the Shep CMC64. I'm using a new ABX tool that I just learned about on the Reaper forum. It was created by a gentleman who calls his company Lacinato Software. There will be a link in the uh, description of this video and also in the blog post that accompanies it. So we're going to run through a little demo of using the Lacinato Software Java-based ABXer. Now since it's Java-based, it's cross-platform. You can use it on Mac. Linux or PC. Let's uh, pull in some files and do a little ABXing. The CMC, the Sheps file, and now here's the Rode NT 2A. And uh, we can listen to those files by pressing the play button. There's the Sheps, and there's the Rode. This little guy here lets us start the uh, comparison someplace besides the beginning of the file. If we find a location where we think the differences are most evident, we can adjust this so that we can start right at that point and go back and forth between the two files. So that's a way to make comparisons easier. We don't have to listen from the beginning every time. So that's pretty much the story. Once we hit Start ABX, we'll be presented with an X. We can still listen to A, the Sheps, and B, the Road NT2A, along with X, the unknown, and then make a decision as to which is which. It just so happens that I understand, I've read, that a dual diaphragm mic tends toward omni pickup pattern and low frequencies, and that means it picks up more low frequencies. Omni's have a, a, a stronger bass response than cardioids. So I would think that if I listen to the lowest note I can find, that'll be a good place to tell the two of them apart. And I just heard a low note right, right there. So we want to find that note. So by being able to start pretty close to that bass note, I think I can hear a difference. To me, the, the Sheps A sounds a little bit lighter in bass than the Rode NT2A B. So let's listen. We'll start ABX. sounds like A rather than B so I'll choose A and now we've made one trial let's try the next X yeah, to, me that, to me that one sounds like B I hear more a fatter bass next one Ten trials, let's see what it looks like. Eight out of ten correct. A 95% confidence level, there's a pretty good chance I can actually hear a difference between the two. There's uh, your introduction to the Lacinato ABX slash shootouter. If you need an ABXer, I, I find this one to be very handy and useful, and I hope that the information that I just came up with is useful to you.